Should I take the vaccine? Yes. Based on who say so? Well, as always, we go back to our most reliable sources. Oh, you mean the World Health Organization? No. Bill Gates? No. Y you surely don't mean Boris? No, I do not mean Boris Johnson. I mean, go back to our beloved Prophet Muhammad. May the peace, blessings and mercy of Allah be with him. You will remember the hadith about the Bedouin man who was leaving his camel without tying it. And our Prophet Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon him, asked him, why don't you tie down your camel? The Bedouin answered, I put my trust in Allah. So our beloved Prophet, peace be upon him, said, tie your camel and then put your trust in Allah. Doesn't mention anything about a vaccine. No, it doesn't. But it does talk a great deal about taking personal responsibility. Oh, so you mean do everything in your power first and then place your trust in Allah. Does this include medicine? Yes. It also says in the Hadith, our beloved Prophet, peace be upon him, said, make use of medical treatment, for Allah has not made a disease without appointing a remedy for it, with the exception of just one disease. That's old age. So in effect, this means that it's incumbent upon us to take a vaccine to prevent ill health and disease, not only to ourselves, but also by stopping the spread of disease to others. Okay, does the vaccine contain any pork products? No. Does the vaccine contain any fetal cells? No. And all this is confirmed for us by Muslim doctors and prominent scholars. So in effect, there's nothing about this vaccine which is haram? No. And it's not just us that's saying that. It's the prominent scholars and the Muslim doctors. Will taking the vaccine kill me? We all know that it's COVID-19 that is the killer. I know because COVID-19 killed my mum in April 2020. She had coronavirus, plain and simple. If the vaccine had been around prior to April, my mum might still be here today talking to us. It wasn't around then, but it is here now. And the Quran and the Hadith are very clear. We must do all we can to protect ourselves. And we have no right to jeopardise the safety of others around us. So come on, guys. All our brothers and sisters in Islam. Brothers and sisters in humanity. Tie your camel. Take the vaccine. And stay safe. And inshallah, we will see you in the next video.